Uh, greetings, San Bonan. Um, my name is Dalton Vusmuzo Mashangane, and I'm, I'm, I'm the host of uh, Uzweni. Um, as promised, yeah, we are here. We are here to ensure that we deliver that which was promised to your good self. So we start our engagement by engaging regular, ordinary, sane men of, of, of our, our, our townships or of our various spaces, where we, we, we actually now try and find a solution to the problem of black people not being tolerant to each other. So the topic of the day is why are black people not tolerant to each other? What separates the black skin from the black skin? Why do other black people think that they are better than other black people? Why is there tribalism? Why is there issues of having to deal with the fact that I speak a different language and another person speaks a different language and then we isolate ourselves based on that? Join me as we talk to Amachi, people who are connected to, to the whole system, who are affected by the whole thing that is happening. Join me as we explore it and talk about it and engage deeply into it. It's not going to be a very easy exercise. We are going to take some time to find a solution to the problem. But we will continue to talk until we find a way. Okay, now, I would just like to speak to the issue of... Um, black people intolerance. Uh, in actual fact, I will say it is not necessarily an issue or a problem that is only amongst black people. Um, I've seen that it's an issue that we have across all, uh, it's actually it's a society issue that we have. But just to uh, uh, specify or being specific with black, my, uh, black people, I think we've, we've become more arrogant and uh, we think we know it all. Uh, once a person makes it in life or has achieved something, be it driving a better car or whatsoever, they, they think their opinion matters m more than anybody else's opinion. Um, you can see this even in politics, religion or whatsoever, and people don't even bother sometimes to get more information regarding a, a, a certain belief or a religion or a political view, you'll find people like shooting down a certain organization without even knowing the policies and anything of that organization. So it's just a matter of being arrogant and thinking you know it all without even knowing all the facts about the other uh, uh, poly or, 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 or it could be a religion or whatsoever or just a general view of, the, uh, of our society. So I think to, to, to sort out all this problem, we just have to go back to our roots and understand what is it um, that you need to know about a specific person or let's say even to respect. I think mostly if you can respect a person without even knowing what they have or how much money they, 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 they are worth or maybe how much educated they are. Because sometimes you can get a knowledge from someone who has never been in school. So that's the other way we can look at it to say, let's start by respecting each other and not put um, everything uh, uh, into a material value to say, if I want to listen to someone, that person must be known to have one and two or something that is more, is more richer than anybody else. So I think that's where we've lost it, that we've made everything about material things instead of understanding and trying to know everything about a specific problem. So I, I, I think that's what will make us be able to, 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 to sort out this issue. So I think the best solution would say we need to start respecting each other and try to be passionate about people. Just give a person a chance and listen to their views and understand where are they coming from. Because there's so much that you can learn without even uh, 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 reading a book or by getting information from uh, 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 an, an individual. So if you need be, then you go uh, further to study more about that per, 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 uh, uh, about that per, uh, specific point or whatever. It could be a religion, it could be a politic or whatsoever, but just to know and give yourself time to listen to the other person, understand what their point, where are they coming from about whatever that they believe in. And then you go and do your own research if you maybe you are not satisfied just to get more information. So it's, it's, it's basically that, so, so that you know. Because in most cases, people are fighting over 
things that are not even sure about that they've never bothered to research on or to get information or just to listen to another person to say for instance if you speak at the issue of religion why do you think christianity is better than uh, islamic or muslim religions why it's uh, uh, the, the the other one which is called uh, maybe we can speak of the rasta rastafarian uh, religion why do you think those people that uh, smoke uh, daka just because they are smoking tobacco, now you think they are mad or they don't have any view. But have you ever sit down and thought or maybe speak to, engage to them and say, guys, what is it that you believe in? Why are you believing in this? Where, where is your source? What, what is it that you know that you probably don't know? Yeah, thanks Muslim Taga for the opportunity with this cool on the topic. I think um, this topic, ever deep in a sense, you would see from us black people, we have different beliefs. And that's where the problem also starts. Where in the same space, there's two, there's different people about believer in different things. And, and, and yes, footy, economical. Because once you believe in something and then it works for you, and then a variety, and then we start judging or looking you, uh, at you in a different way. So zip I like in lazy, that makes us sit in and see intolerant against each other. But but yeah, I think I think basically it's that the beliefs, the 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 the, 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 the education as well, because what we we. We, we were taught was to be better than the other one. And if you don't do this well, then you are a failure. And everyone that, uh, that fails is be, being looked down on. So it's all another view, because you grow up especially when you're a child. Uh, 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 uh. Then you come into a society where there's different beliefs. Uh, 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 and then you go with a group that, 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 that suits you with your beliefs, but you are still living in the same space. Oh, uh, thank you very much, uh, Mr. Mtaga, for the uh, invite. Uh, it means a lot. You don't have an idea. Uh, this kind of an invite, it says a lot to an individual. Yes. Uh, I think the problem starts, uh, it's mainly based on education. Because if Ogasheva, like, Nwana Haile Fei, like, Kusko Long, Bamutrita, otherwise, not only Kusko Long, even from a more modern thing, the parents, Ufei Lawena, Ufei Lawena, Basically, <clears throat> remember, you cannot be all doctors or teachers. You see, that's why previously, no, not the technical schools. If we are to learn, education, then we are going to technical school as a So, I don't know. I decided to even now the those things, the technical schools, they were there back then. And then the opportunity in the baring at, but now, but sorry, but now baring, but in case baring programmingly, or school is the way, school is the way. They didn't even bring the idea. You are the the entrepreneurs. So I think ki 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 more relatable thing.